Hey guys, Ben Graham here with Remax, your South Chandler realtor. Wanted to bring a very exciting topic to you guys, and that seven secrets to save thousands of dollars when financing a home. Who doesn't want to save money? So let's get into those. Got a lot to cover today. It's going to be a little bit longer, a video, a couple minutes at the most, and um, you can get the full article from me if you would like as well, just to read it. So. Without further ado, let's jump right in. The first is the basic question, how much can you afford? I never encourage anyone to buy or sell unless they are in a place that they can financially and as their family um, can make the move happen. So let's assess that situation first, your debt to income ratio, how much home you can actually afford, what your other debt, student loan, car, credit card payments look like, all rolled in and um, get you a good sense of what you can actually afford and are comfortable with. We don't have to spend as much as you can actually afford though. So um, would love to chat further about that with you guys as well. I've got a lot of strong opinions about um, the Dave Ramsey debt-free uh, philosophies, etc. I would love to explore that with you. So number two is be prepared. I cannot stress that enough. Um, in fact, we'll probably won't even go start looking at the homes, the fun part of this until you are at least pre-qualified, if not pre-approved, which is just another layer of um, loan qualification process to make sure that we've checked pay stubs, W-2s, uh, taxes, your employment verification, credit score, etc. Um, and then also we want to look about, not we, but the lender is going to look to make sure that you have the down payment and of course the earnest money uh, that you'll need to close on the house. So we'll need all that before we get to the fun stuff of looking at homes. Secret number three is understand the basics, okay? It's going to take money the overall cost of the loan, the down payment, the interest rate, the term of the loan, 15 or 30 year, and the type of the loan. All of those factors affect one another and of course will affect you in the overall cost, the monthly cost. It, they'll affect your uh, negotiating power when we go to write offers on homes. So a lot is going to happen here and it will definitely behoove you to learn as much as you can and understand this part of the process. And then continuing on learning the lingo, really learning the secret, behind the secret, of how the mortgage lenders get paid and helping you maximize the best deal possible. Now, I'm not trying to cut them out. They are providing an awesome service to you um, to get you a loan, but it does help to understand what is going on and what you are paying for, the origination fees, the points, the lock period, the junk fees, etc. So again, knowledge is power, understand those. Um, would love to help you there too. And then questions to ask is basically about the above, origination fees, points, lock period, junk fees, and any other um, fees associated with closing on the property. So that'll, so far, a lot of great ways to save you money and then next we're getting into some big ones here is cost comparison if you want to compare a couple lenders and if you're decided on one lender awesome I work with a great lender but do compare the difference between a 15 year or third year you know 4.75 interest to a 5.25 interest rate etc just to see the monthly and overall cost differences so definitely do some comparison there. And then finally, the biggest secret to saving thousands on your mortgage is to simply make one more payment a year. Either do that one time a year, spread it out over 12 months, just divide up your, your monthly and just tack it on. Um, every time you make a payment, do a bi-weekly strategy. So there's, a, there's basically three ways to do it, either monthly, yearly, or bi-weekly. But making that one extra payment every single year will literally save you tens of thousands of dollars. I do that on my home and extrapolate it out is going to save me about 50000 bucks over the course of the loan. So hopefully this um, video blog was interesting, insightful, helpful. Would love to dive deeper into this and set you up with an awesome lender as well. 
Call, text, email with questions. Take care.